happened here? You haven't done a good job of hiding it. Just divert more money towards your Echo budget. Because he really was so cute with his little arms and legs. I just wanted to squeeze them all up, but then they took him away. Uh, and then the other thing I liked about the movie was that it did a great job of showing how far kids have come. You know, I said in the beginning that this movie is very similar to E.T., and it is. It borrows a lot from E.T., but it's missing one vital element, which I'll get to in a moment. Uh, but it really illustrates that how far kids have come in terms of technology and how capable they are. Uh, you know, of course, when Elliot and Gert found uh, E.T., they fed him candy, they played with him, they did dress up, but, you know, they really were at a loss as what to, what to do to help him phone home. Uh, but these kids, they would have been like, what's the number, E.T.? And I thought that was very entertaining, uh, just to, to show that, um, how far kids have progressed. Uh, so, but this movie, you know, it's a great idea that they introduce, but they don't do anything with it. And I would say, though, that I don't want to undercut Elliot and Gert, because what they did, which was so phenomenal, is they showed tremendous bravery and heart you know, strength of character, uh, particularly the end of E.T., uh, and that never happens here. This movie does not have any strength of character or heart or soul or bravery. I mean, there's some bravery, I guess, but things happen so quickly and you never emotionally connect to the characters that you don't really feel it like the way you do in E.T. when that bike takes off. There's no moment like that here. Uh, and it, it's, a, it's a shame. Maybe it focuses too much on the technological aspects and the found footage aspects and forgets to put a soul into the film. Is it the child actor's fault? I don't think so. I'm not quite sure. The child actors were good, but again, as I said, I had a hard time connecting with them, and they seemed a little too precocious. I, I'm not sure if it's their fault or the script's fault, because they all spoke not so much like precocious children, but as how adult 